Space is Sims, and as you can tell, we are here with a, I would say a whole new game, but it's not. It's a game demo. And as you can clearly tell from the title and the thumbnail and where we are now, it is a Persona 5 based visual novel that is fan made. Obviously, disclaimer, um, spoilers, possibly for Persona 5 if you've never played it, uh, if you've never played Persona 5, this might not interest you at all. But also spoilers if you've never played it, potentially. Um, so I'm going to link the itch.io page below where you can play the game demo. It's in the works. So it's, I don't know how long the demo is. Um, but right now, um, the information about the demo is the MC's basic personality to pay, uh, personality changes depending on if you choose the sun arcana or the moon arcana which you select at the start of the game um they note that it contains mild swearing but if you've ever been here before we swear like a sailor so put on your big bitch panties and get fucking ready for that shit so if you don't like swearing this is not the channel for you hi are you new here welcome um Right now, romanceable characters is Akira or Ren. You can choose, depending if you want to go with the game name or the anime name. Uh, which is always weird to me that they do that, but the side... Anyway. Uh, Ryuji and Akechi. Um, so it's unfinished stories as it's just a prototype. So we're going to be bummed out, is all I'm going to tell you. Uh, so, but in the works is Yusuke and An. So let's just hope they continue with this. Because my dreams of being able to date Yusuke are a little crushed right now. I was really excited when I saw this demo and I was like, I can date Yusuke. And then it's like, not yet. <sighs> We're crushing my dreams. Um, But I also can't actually live my real ship of Joker and Fox. We can't just, but it's fine. Whatever. It's okay. Um, So yeah, there's all that. Uh, so obviously everything included in this game demo, all the assets, the music, clearly the music right now. Um, is owned by Atlas. Obviously, we're probably going to get copyrighted for this theme song. So, um, that being said, uh, again, I'll put the itch.io page down below so you can go. You can check out the page. You can check out... Um, I think Catherine is her name uh, that is doing this, but she's got a team of a couple of people uh, that are working... Um, I wonder if... They, do they have it? This is all the assets page to full source. Yeah, I think that's assets credit page. No, so that's bringing you to their credit page. It's not coming up in the game. Um, And unfortunately, when you first open the game, it, it tells you all the name of everybody who's kind of working on it. But I didn't like screenshot or anything, so I can't tell you. So, But go there to check them out. Um, And on that, underneath the demo page, there is also a link that you can go um, and buy them a coffee if you feel so inclined, because obviously they can't make money off this game because Atlas owns the rights to everything and you can't, you know what I mean? They can, I'm guessing, make a fan demo game. It's freebies, but they can't sell it. So if you feel so inclined, you can go donate to them and buy them a coffee. And if you feel so inclined, you can buy us a coffee here too, because we're probably going to get copyright struck for this. And... Well, we're just not going to, like, any ads you might have seen at the beginning, they're going to take my four cents. Poor Atlas, you're only making four cents off my ass, because we make nothing here. But anyway, um, shameless plug for my coffee link. That is below. <laughs> you feed, you don't feed me coffee, you feed peanuts to the bird. If you've been here before, he's sitting jammed under my neck right now. He will probably peep and, well, he just did, but uh, anyway. I accidentally, when I first came in, I clicked, aren't you tired? And, uh, yeah. So I think that's all I have to say about that. Uh, I don't, again, I don't know how long this game is. I had already started. Um. Okay. I had already kind of came in here, and I screwed up. We got to this point, right? Oh, God, I forgot I got to do the things. So we have to do our first and last name. We had to do our persona name. And I was like, oh, okay. I couldn't think it took me like five minutes, okay, to think of a persona name. And then I'm dumb because I've actually never played persona. I have watched, I watched the Nian Cave 
stream persona, okay? Because I suck at games like this, but I watch them play and I fucking love the game, but I can't play it, but I love it, but I can't play it. You know what I'm saying? I suck at games. So I watch other people play games like that, like visual novels. I suck at those, but we can manage those. We choose all the wrong shit. Otome games, we suck at them, but we can play those because all I have to do is click. If I have to do any kind of fucking skill, we're fucked. Okay. Basically. So, um, yeah. So if you want to get into persona lore and all that shit, uh, I'm not going to be able to do that because it's been a while since I've actually, well, they did just do royal, but eh, anyway. Um, but yeah, I'm dumb because I was like, oh my God, I was, when I was thinking persona name, I was actually thinking code name. And then when I clicked confirm, it went to code name and I went, fuck. So I had to stop and think, and I am not good. If we get a better, like if they continue with this and there's another demo or a full version of the game, guys, guys, you're going to help to help me with a persona name. Okay. And a code name. And the best I could come up with because I'm like, well, I'm a crazy bird lady and there's owls all over my apartment. So I was like, okay. But that had, that was, I was thinking code names. So look, it's lame. Okay. But it's okay. And because we are spacey and we are the captain of our own crazy ship, we're, our persona is the captain. That's what I came up with. I suck at this. Okay. Did I spell captain right? I think I did. <laughs> And then I was like, code name. Okay, code name is Owl. Because I was like, ever mo- not everybody has. A lot of them have. Well, no, there's Fox and Panther and Queen. We can't be Queen. You know what I mean? Anyway. So, which name do you want to use? We're using Akira, okay? Because that's, you know. Can we go to config for a second? Okay. We need to turn the sound volume down just a little bit. Okay. Um. So I don't know. It says, do you saw that there's voice volume? I don't think they can use the voices. Maybe they have a couple because I'm thinking you. Can I just tell you though, using the, although this background, doesn't that actually look like, was it Persona 3? It looks like a background of a different one, but um, are we supposed to be Igor right now? Oh. Why, hello there, Sims Spacey. I've been waiting for you, you know. Um, what? <laughs> oh, don't worry. You won't be here long. It's honestly amazing how you managed to stumble into this space. Don't get me wrong, I'm happy nonetheless. People don't come here often. I'm not doing his voice justice. Like, none of the voice realized. I just want you to know. If you've played the game, my voices are not going to be anything like their actual voices in English or Japanese. Okay. But if there are voices, it's on. Because I'm intrigued by that, but... I'm sure you have a lot of questions and you're itching to progress, yes? Let's get to it, then. Nobody asked you, little bird. Nobody asked you either, but I love you. Firstly, yes. Go on, pick a card. Oh. What card do you see in your hand? Oh, okay. What card do you see in your hand? This is where you can pick your arcana, the sun or the moon. So what we'll probably do for the demo is we'll go through one and try to do everything we can. I wonder if you choose your romance character or if it's based on your choices that you make. I don't know. We'll find out. And again, I don't know how long this is. Bird! God, shut up! Okay, seriously, donate coffee to get a muzzle for that one. He's being a dick. Your little bird friend's being a jerk. You need to go tell him to be quiet. Okay? Um. So we'll start with the sun and then we'll do the moon. Ah, the sun. Good fortune. Happiness. Harmony. What is your actual fucking problem? What is your fucking problem? You have, like, been quiet until now. Why? Why are you a jerk? He does this. Just because he wants me to tell him off. And then everyone thinks I'm mean. Because he's a jerk. The little bird is a fucking jerk. Okay. He's a jerk. 
He's a jerk because he wants to play with you, but you just want to snuggle with me because you're a good boy. Go tell your little bird friend to shut up. He's, he's screaming because he wants to play with Neelix, but... Do you hear him? Can you hear him where he's breaking his voice because he's screaming so much? And his voice is getting all hoarse, but he still doesn't shut up. He's such an asshole. Anyway. I see. You have a bright, cheerful personality, and you like to connect with people. Well, that's definitely not me. We are definitely more of a moon, I'm assuming, but... Also, moon, Yusuke. <laughs> Can't do that yet. Though you might come off as too friendly or too straightforward sometimes, it's what makes people unknowingly... It's what makes people unknowingly get drawn to you. Okay, well. That's unfortunate, but all right. Like how the planets naturally orbit around the sun. And so will you light up the way of people around you or burn them down to ashes. I'm looking forward to see your results. Are you sure this is the card you want? Are you sure this is the card you want? Yes, I'm sure. Very well, then. Let's move on. Next, select the route you wish to proceed with. Oh, cool. Don't be shy now. Tell me who you desire. Nice. <laughs> Seriously? Will you go tell him to be quiet, please? Thank you. He just wants you to play with him, and I just want him to shut up, so you're going to have to take one for the team there, bud. <laughs> Poor Neelix. He's like, excuse me? Yeah, well, yeah, you wanted a bird friend, and Auntie Michelle was getting rid of this asshole. Well, supposedly, he's, I mean, he gets to come out and play, and he has a bird friend, and he, but he's so fucking mean. He's so fucking obnoxious. Oh my god, he's driving me crazy. He's being nicer lately. So it's nice, like, I've, he's lived here for a fucking year. And, like, most of the time he's actually getting a little bit better and nicer, and you can talk to him. But then he just does this for, like, an hour at night, and it's like, I just want to throw something at you. <laughs> I'm not gonna. I threaten it. Because I just want to. But it's, I feel like it's like people with kids, like, I just want to strangle them! You're not gonna actually do it, but, you know. <sighs> And if it's your first time here, this is the bullshit we deal with. Anyway, um, we're going to on. S wait, 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 wait. What's on second thought? That's interesting. It says romance targets is Ryuji, but he's not here. Well, we're going to go with Akira first because that's what we do. Ah, the fool. <laughs> I mean, that was his Argonia. Perhaps his unpredictability is what's attractive about him, don't you think? I mean, he's also main protag, so... Now are you sure this is the path you wish to go on? Yes, I'm sure. I like the fact that it make it gives you the option to go back. Good, good. I couldn't go back when I fucked up my persona name, though. Like, I... <laughs> I kind of wish there was a go back option on that, because I fucked that up. But that was me. I'm pretty sure most people would have known exactly. But I was like, oh, I'm stupid. I forgot. Persona, code name, two different things. Now you're ready to go. I hope you manage to reach the goal you're aiming for. I wish you full enjoyment and good luck, dear. Started to sound kind of like an old lady there. But all my voices kind of sound like an old lady. You're welcome. <laughs> This is great. Nice. Wow. I mean, they took all the, like, I mean, it's literally all the assets from, oh. This seems a new background. Dear Owl, that's us. We've been exchanging these letters for about a year now, but you always manage to keep me entertained by your roller coaster of a life that you're living. The fuck? That or you must have a penchant for storytelling. About the teachers in your school that you dubbed human trash in your last letter. Oh my god. The, yeah, no, I need teacher, teachers like that. That's just awful. How's the principal or the authorities not getting alerted by it? What about the other teachers? Is everyone turning a blind eye when there are clear signs of physical abuse on the students? That's just ridiculous. I heard about the rampage cases in Tokyo from the news these days. Hope you're not getting involved in those incidents. Be careful when you're out and about. You know, it's funny that you mentioned things like superheroes and all that stuff. I was thinking the same thing. It's kind of funny because it's like supposed to be lined on the paper, but it doesn't quite line up. It doesn't 
why it went up. Um, you mentioned things like superheroes and all those stuff. It should be that stuff. All those. It doesn't work either. There. All right. A little bit of editing. A little bit of editing. But I'm... Okay. Hi. Hi. We've played, like... Actual, professionally produced games that are just train wrecks. So... But it's just a few things. Just a couple points. Just need to fix some... I'm not good at grammar, but if I notice these things... Hmm. If only we have the power to change this... If only we had the power to change society, to move hearts, to prove our sense of justice, maybe then we could have some kind of impact in the world. I get what they're trying to say there, but it is weird. If only we have the power to change society, to move hearts, maybe then we can have some kind of impact in the world. Can or could... Yeah, but the have, it should be... If only we had it. Because you're thinking theoretically, even though we technically do, if you're calling me owl for... Like... It's intriguing. On a lighter note, we'll be second year soon, huh? There's nothing much going on over here since it's a small city, but still, feels like time flies really fast. I can't imagine how you feel living in such a huge city like Tokyo, where things are constantly happening around you. As usual, I'm looking forward to hearing more of your life stories in your next letter. Signed, Arsene. Oh. <laughs> Wait. Why is he signing it as Arsene, but he addressed ours to our code name? And he's using his persona name. Interesting. What should I use to reply? Minimalistic design papers, nature theme papers, vintage looking papers, normal plain. Oh, fuck. I don't know. Oh, God. No, this is not. Okay. Well, so I'm confused. So. Okay. I'm assuming one's the right answer. For, I wonder if that letter is the same no matter who, but it just signed different. You know what I mean? I'm, well, I'm curious. We'll find out. Normal plain paper. Hmm. Okay, so we're going with Akira, right? Okay, I feel like for Akechi, it's vintage. I feel like we got to go for that later. Um, although I want to do... Hmm. Let's use the minimalistic. Let's go for the top. We could go through and choose all the options. Dear Fancy Thief Man. Dear Fancy Thief Man. Dear Fancy Thief Man. <laughs> oh my god, we actually get to choose our writing. Uh, let's go for the second one. That's fun. Dear Fancy Thief Man. It's almost... Is it almost a year already? Wow, that's so weird to think about. Remember those awkward early letters where we were trying to sound all dignified and proper? Cringe. You'll never believe what happened to me today. I hope you're sitting down when you're reading this. Okay. <laughs> I hope you're sitting down while you're reading this. Today, I met the most handsome one of all. The goodest boy. The one and only Punko, the Welsh Corgi. Corgi. Why did I read that as Corgi? Wow, Corgi. I can't read. Punko, the Welsh Corgi. His owner was this middle-aged lady, and she let me pet him for a good five whole minutes. I literally sat down on the ground while giving him his much-deserved belly rubs. It was awesome. I printed a photo. I know you have a certain fondness for cats, but look at him! Look at how fluffy his butt looks! Ahem. <clears throat> Sorry about that. I'll get down to the roller coaster now and try to... I'll get down... I'll get down from, I think. I'll get down from the roller coaster now and try to calm down. On to more serious topics. Regarding the human trash, unfortunately, I'm pretty sure most of those people know what's happening. But everyone doesn't consider it abuse. They consider it a normal occurrence. It's really sad. I wish I could do more. I wish I... I wish I can do more. Could do more. I wish I could do more, but my efforts didn't seem to matter. Hmm. But I'd like to think at the very least we can create small ripples in the sea. And it might be minuscule, but hopefully at least one person resonates with it. You know, you should come to Tokyo someday. I swear I'm not a creep when I say this, but I'd love to hang out with you in person. I can show you my favorite spots, bring you to this maid cafe in Akihabara, and we can even go fishing if you want. Honestly, it's not exactly my favorite type of activity, but I'll do it just because it's you. Be warned that I might talk your ears off, though. <laughs> I would do that, absolutely. I'll try my best to keep out of trouble, but no promises. As for you, stay mostly safe and keep being you, Arsene. I have a feeling our second year of high school is going to be awesome. 
<laughs> okay. Okay. I'm sorry. There is no way in hell we can't go with Toodles. Um, if you've been around for the second channel, uh, where we just do other videos, I started off being like, Toodles! And I was like, that's stupid. But it's become a thing, and now we just say Toodles, and... I love you, game! I love you for letting me say, Toodles! Toodles! Ow. <laughs> toodles. <laughs> oh, God. Great. Oh, shit, I can't read. Hello! Is that... Catrin? Catrin? Is it supposed... I think... I can't quite read behind, because my thing is here. Here, speaking. Okay, I'm the game's project starter, and... The a main person taking care of this VN? Okay, my, it's unfortunately my pop-up hub for my thing is right there. You've completed one of the scenarios. Wow, thanks so much for picking up this small project of mine and trying it out. That's it? Oh, that's so sad. I hope you enjoyed the experience of Alpha 2.0 release. And hey, if you haven't already, you should consider trying out different answers. There's some dialogues that'll show up only in certain conditions. I also hope you checked out all the routes available. They were really fun to write and the writers had... And the writers have worked really hard on them. But of course, it's all up to you. Oh, god damn it. Okay. The game itself is currently just a demo. I'm trying to see how many people are interested. And I'm still planning to continue the stories as long as I'm still motivated to do so. Well, yeah, because, like, we no sprites, no nothing. I just wrote a letter. I'm sad. It's fun, though. Don't get me wrong. I am enjoying this. But I... And it's also one of those... No, but I want more, though. As of now, they have four writers, including me, for this game. They're all casually writing for the project on the side for free, so please be kind to us. Sarah is writing for Ryu Ryuji's Sun and Moon routes. She'll also help the beta scripts when she has the time to, and she's worked on several release titles before, so you Ryuji fans are in good hands. Kitty is writing for Akira and Goro's Sun routes. You can find her on Twitter under, there's her Twitter, AO3 under, there you go, what's AO3? I don't know. Uh, go check out her Twins AU fic, it's a masterpiece, and her coffee... There you go. Also, if you, like, you can go donate. Is it Catrin? Catrin? I don't know why I kept calling her Catherine, but I guess it's Catrin. I don't know. Anyway, um, on, like I said, the itch.io page will be down below. There's a coffee link there, probably for Catrin, but you can also download the demo, and then you can be able to find them here. There you go. Rain's writing Yusuke's moon route. Oh! Oh, thank God. It said more routes depending on interested writers currently. And then there was that. So, okay. Okay, we appreciate you for Yusuke's moon route and An's moon route. Her Wattpad account. And you should definitely check out her Persona book. Okay. As for me, I'm writing for Akira and Goro's moon routes. You can find me at Twitter. There you go. There's your Twitter. Updates about the game will be regularly posted there. And while I don't have anything written for Persona 5, I don't know what AO3. Okay. If you want to check it out, if you're a writer and you want to help out with writing for other character routes, I suggest you check out this page. And that's a good point. So there you go. You could probably find the information on itch.io or you can download the demo and check that out. So if you're an aspiring writer for anything, try. You never know. Don't be like me. No, my writing is... I have not done that since like high school. But, like, don't be like me and be like, I fail at everything, so I don't bother trying. Try. Try, children. Do what Grandma Spacey says and go out and try your hardest. If you're an artist and you want to help out expanding the expressions of the official sprites or work on backgrounds or CGs, check out that page there. With that said, thank you for playing the game. I hope to see your feedback comments in the itch.io page. Here's to hoping the project will grow as planned. Hope to see you around. There you go. That makes me so sad that that was it, though. <laughs> It really does. Okay. I guess we can do new game. Do I have to put my name in every single time? Oh, damn it, we do. Okay. Oh, you know what? We'll save when we get in there. That'll be easier. Our persona is the captain. Not that we needed it. Not that I needed it. Okay. Because we didn't use it yet. Okay. 
that doesn't matter at this point. But I mean, I get where there, you know what I mean? Um, save. Let's do that. So that's what we can just come back here. Okay. So can we skip? Uh, oh, we, let's do dot, dot, dot this time. Not a very talkative one. Hmm. Or perhaps you're just confused. It's honestly amazing how you managed to stumble into this space. Okay. What card? I'm still going to pick the sun. Let's do all the options. Ah, oh, the sun. Are you sure? Yes, I'm sure. Don't be shy. Who do you desire? We're going to go with Akira again. Yes, I'm sure. Good, good. Okay. Now, actually, let's just save here as well. Um, what did we use last time? We used nature theme papers. I didn't look at the paper when we did it. Dear Fancy Thief Man. Oh, look! Anyway. It's almost a year already. Wow, that's so weird to think about. Remember those awkward early letters where we were trying to sound all dignified and proper? Cringe. I... Oh, you'll never believe what happened to me today. You'll never believe what happened to me today. Today I met the most handsome one of all. The goodest boy. The one and only Punko, the Welsh Corgi. His owner was this middle-aged lady and she let me pet him for a good five whole minutes. Okay. It was on... Okay, so that's the same. I printed a photo. I know you have a certain fondness for cats, but look at him! Look at how fluffy his butt looks! I do wish for this that they had, like, put in a little, like, here's the picture of the corgi butt. You know what I mean? Because, like, I printed a photo, and we said, look at him. I do wish that that would pop in. So, sorry about that. Um, on to more serious topics. Okay. I hope some sort of miracle happens. I have some sort of miracle happens because I've tried, but it's impossible to do this alone. I guess in the end, both you and I are just a drop of water in the big vast sea. But I'd like to think at the very least we can create ripples, and it might be minuscule, but hopefully at least one person resonates with it. You know, you should come to Tokyo someday. I swear I'm not a creep when I say this, but I'd love to hang out with you in person. Okay, that's the same. Okay, yep. Talk your ears off. Mostly safe. With lots of love. Owl. Okay. So, those are the only different options aside from the paper choice, but, okay. Load game. Let's actually go back here. I want to see what the vintage papers look like. We've done all the other options. Oh, except for this. Wow, I like this. Okay. You'll never believe what happened to me today. I wish I could do more. Efforts didn't seem to matter. I'd like to think at the very least we can create a small ripple. In okay, that's the same, though. Okay. And then we can do toodles again. Okay. All right. I just want to see the different paper types because that's basically all we could do. We're doing all the options. Normal plane. Okay. Let's actually go to... Skip. Okay. Hope you're sitting down when you're reading this. Hope some sort of miracle happens. Toodles again. Okay, cool. I want to actually go back because I want to see what the minimalistic design papers look like because I wasn't paying attention. Oh, okay, cool. Hello. All right. Um, load. Let's go back here. Yes. I mean, I knew it was going to be short, but I'm a little sad. It's very short. Oh, hello there. Uh, dot, dot, dot. Okay. We're still going to pick the sun now. Skip. Yes, I'm sure. And let's go with Akechi. I would have... Oh, my, my. I would advise you tread... Tread, not thread. Okay, there's some minor typos and some editing that needs to be done, grammar-wise. That's it. Um, So it just needs to be cleaned up a little, but demo, like, it's not bad. But I'm sure people have mentioned that, like, you know, there's just some, like, grammar kind of issues and... It should be tread, not thread carefully, but... So it's little things like that, but, you know. Now tread carefully and take care to balance the scale, hmm? Now, are you sure this is the path you wish to go on? What happens if I say, take your time and think about who you really want? Okay. Okay, so it just loops you back. I just wanted to say, yes, I'm sure. Good, good. Now you're ready to go. I hope you manage to reach the goal you're aiming for. I wish you full enjoyment and good luck, dear. We're just going to get another letter. It's going to be sick and it's going to end so fast. But it's fun. Oh. Sunday the 17th. Oh. 
Oh, interesting. Milk, dry snacks, puddings. Oh my god, let's get the Persona 5 music in the background. I love it. Hmm, I think that should be all. Looking up from your groceries list, you observe the area and try to remember where you're supposed to go next. Ow! You throw the two girls who just bumped into you and nearly ruined your groceries out. What the fuck look? But they don't seem to notice. Oh, sorry. Wait, excuse me. Did you see him? We saw him coming this way. Uh, what who? You know, the Detective Prince, Kechigoro. He's really famous. He's like our age, but his accomplishments as a detective are even more than most adult detectives. He's also really handsome. Yes, yes, he's got those pretty light brown locks. And deep, dark red eyes. Uh, okay, I think I've seen him on the TV, yeah. Maybe, possibly, perhaps. Who cares, really? Did you see him around by any chance? We were telling him, but he walked so quickly. Right. I don't know. He's probably at the main street. You're right. Maybe we saw him wrongly. We saw him wrong. Oh, maybe we saw wrongly. Okay. That makes more sense. Why would he come to this alleyway? There's nothing here. Yep. Just me. I'm nothing. This game gets me. <laughs> Aww. Let's go. We might be able to spot him if he's still around the area. Don't give up yet. Okay, thanks, random passerby. Don't mention it. The two girls rush toward the main street, and you sigh wistfully. Man, I sure hope that Detective Princess or whatever gets away. <laughs> Detective Princess! <laughs> we kind of funny. <laughs> Being a celebrity sure is tough. I hope that was put in there on purpose and not a typo, because that's fucking hilarious. Now, what was I doing again? Your brain isn't re responding much, and you sigh at the state of lethargy that it's in. Well, at least you know what to do now. Get caffeine. I can smell it. Somewhere in this area, I can smell it. It's the smell of roasted coffee beans. Mm. It should be around here. Oh my god, we're going to LeBron. That's what I was just thinking. Wait, 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 wait. Wait. You know what would be better? I'm just going to say right now, I'm going to call it what would be better for this game to con well, it would be better if it continued, obviously. But what would be better is I know you're doing it based on the regular P5, but I'm going to need you. Okay, I know we're supposed to be like in high school, but could we just pretend that we're not for a second? And could we go? Could we just also have a route where we're not and we can and we do Persona 5 Royal? And we can date Snack Daddy. Because Maruki is like... Like the best. Like, I love Yusuke. But like, Snack Daddy... It's a hard decision! All I'm saying. And... Hi. No, I'm not gonna give spoilers for Royal. Because, you know, that's different. But Snack Daddy is best. He's Snack Daddy because he has snacks, and he offers us snacks when you go to therapy. <laughs> that's that's as much spoiler as I'm going to give you, but I love Snack Daddy. And But, like, is Sojuro going to be in here? Because that's kind of awesome. Anyway, you stare at the sign for a few seconds and peek into the shop. It's definitely coming from here, all right. Okay, you know what's really sad about this? We chose Akira... And we just wrote him a letter. We chose Goro and we get to go to LeBlanc. Come on! You're such a tease game! I actually am really enjoying this though. It's like playing Persona 5, but I don't have to do with they I can just visual novel and do the dating visual novel game that I kind of wanted it to be. So anyway. I don't know how to do Sojiro's voice. We got a deep voice. Welcome! Hello! Lovely place you have here. Lovely place you have here. We're just going to go with the top options, and we'll choose the second ones later. Ugh, thanks. You've got a good sense. I'd like to think I do. You take a sweeping look around the area. Only one customer sitting at the counter. Perfect. Any menu recommendations to hook a first-time customer? The shopkeeper points to the menu at the top of the counter. I got a special curry and fresh ground coffee if you're up for it. Sounds awesome to me. You know what's going to be better? 
is when they put it in there, if they do, if eventually they get Sojourner Sprite. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. You need to, they need those here. All right, then. Take a seat and I'll be back with your order soon. Thank you. You sit one chair away from the one customer who'd claimed his seat before you, leaving one chair gap between you and him as per the unspoken courtesy rule of being a good human being. Yes, you also leave one fucking parking space. Unless it's like a crowded lot. But if there are other places to park, never fucking park right on top of someone, assholes. I park my car out in the middle of fuck, but fuck nowhere in a parking lot. Not for you to park on top of me is all I'm saying. Just sitting around waiting for your food is boring, though. Greet the other customer. You clear your throat and turn toward the stranger, flashing a friendly smile. Hi there! The other customer you found out after looking closer is a male, and a pretty one at that. I love this game, it knows what I like. Pretty ones. Sets his cup of coffee down and turns towards you with a polite smile. Do we get at least a- ah! I was like, do we at least get a sprite for him? We do! I'm so excited. I don't know how to do his voice either. Hello. Are the curry and coffee really good? Are the curry and coffee really good? I've yet to try the curry, but the coffee is indeed exquisite. Oh, I knew it! it smells like heaven here. The brunette chuckles at the starry-eyed look you throw as you look around the establishment. What brings you here? The cafe isn't exactly well known. I was in the area for groceries. You point at the eco bags on the floor near your chair. And then I realized I needed caffeine. Because my brain isn't really working at its full capacity after these two girls bumped into me to rant about how they've been basically stalking a detective princess or something like that. I'm sorry, detective what? Yeah, I don't know, his name was Etchy or something? <laughs> a catchy. That! Yes! I'm like, <laughs> can we go back? Look at how sad he looks! I love this demo so much. This is so much... Okay, look, I'm not gonna lie. Maybe the moon one is different, but, like, I'm a little sad that Akira's was just writing a letter. Like, you're like, okay, this is fine, but that's where it ended, and it makes me sad. But I love... This would have been a better one to start with. You know what I'm saying? Actually, I'm glad we started with the letter, because if we had started here, my hopes would have been higher. Like, I know it's just a demo, but, like, a little bummed that we didn't get an Akira sprite, but... I love this. And I just love how sad he looks when he's like, a catchy. Matt, yes! <laughs> I love this. And, well, I certainly have no idea what he looks like. And I probably haven't seen him anyway. So I just randomly told him to check the main street. Because, you know, it's really crowded there. So hopefully they won't be able to find him. I see. Do you know who he is? Do you know who he is? It's easier because there's a lot of choices in this one. So it's easier to choose the top one, and then we'll choose the bottom one. I'd like to think I know him quite well. What's he like? What's he like? Well, he's a detective. Obviously. Perhaps the general public finds his appearance and conduct pleasant to, the, to their eyes. Hence he was nicknamed thus. Ooh, what do you think about him? What do you think about him? Well, everyone generally seems to think he's pleasant. But what do you think? Somehow the stranger smiles, but it doesn't exactly reach his eyes. My opinion doesn't really matter in this case, no. In the grand scheme of things, maybe not. But humor me, I'm still curious. He's so mad now. He's... Sorry for interrupting your chat, but I've got your order. Yummy. Ooh, these look really good. Thank you. Uh, sorry, what's your name, sir? Sojuro. Thanks, Sojuro-san. Yeah, yeah, you're an energetic one, huh? People say that all the time, but I'm just me, you know? The first spoonful of curry touches your tongue and you hum an approval at the deliciousness. It'd <laughs> be so much funny if you're like, I've had better. <gasps> Get out! I'm just kidding. You sip your hot coffee next, and you're convinced Sojuro-san has to be some kind of master chef, or a food magician of some sort, because the two menus work so well together. Man, this is good! Makes you think how the shop is terribly underrated, doesn't it? I feel bad saying this, but... I feel bad saying this, but... I like the idea of this place being a hidden gem in some indistinct alleyway, you know? 
It's like my personal getaway now. Ah, I see we share the same sentiment. Though I suppose that's not exactly good for the business itself. It's funny because they said like his dark red eyes. And I mean, I guess they are red tinted, but I always kind of thought his eyes were more like, like a red brown. More like my own. Thank you very much. They look like black shark eye orbs, but like in incandescent lighting and like natural lighting, they're like red tinted, which I kind of like. You're like red brown. Oh, uh, whoops. You're right. Well, I can at least tell my friends about this place. Be a shame if the shop closes down just because there are not enough customers. The older man chuckles, but gives the two of you a stern look anyway. Flatter me all you want, but none of you kids are getting any discounts. Aw. Well, that's too bad. At least we tried. The boy sets his empty cup down on its saucer and stands up from his seat before withdrawing his wallet. Uh, please ring me up, Sojuro-san. Suddenly, a ringtone that isn't yours fills the entire room, and the boy briefly glances at his cell phone before he hastily accepted the incoming call and slides some cash across the counter's table. Yes, Sai-san. Briefly, you can kind of make out a woman's voice from the phone, along with some words like case and hurry and a catchy. Wait. His hair is a light brown color. The stranger dismisses his call and pocketed his phone back before nodding to Sojuro. Thank you for the coffee, Sojuro-san. Lord of Curry next time, kid. It's not like you're making money with that... It's not like you're not making money with that title of yours. If I have time. His eyes, which you just notice is a deep, dark red, turn towards you. Enjoy your meal. Oh, and this is just a suggestion. Uh, but you should probably see TV more often. <laughs> Was... Did... What? Sojuro-san? Yeah? Did he... Was that a catchy Goro? Only now you notice how amused he looks. Yep. Oh. Huh. Yeah, I probably should start watching TV every now and then. That is so fucking great. That is actually a really perfect place for that one. Because you meet him and you're like, ah, uh, and then you're like, but no, what happens? That is good. That's really good. Um, all right, so let's go back. Uh, um, what? Okay. We're gonna keep, pick the sun again. Yes, I'm sure. And we're gonna go back to Akechi. Yes, I'm sure. Okay. Um. Huh? I don't think they know. No way! Oh, that's true, because... I don't know if I mentioned this, but the MC's looks obviously aren't specified. Well, it says mostly. And you're, since your name's changeable, you're basically gender neutral. So you could play this however you want. You know what I mean? So, you know, in my head, I can live my gay ship fantasies if I really wanted to. I could pretend that right now I'm Akira dating a catchy. <laughs> It'd be really weird. And then later you can be somebody else dating it. You know what I'm just saying? So that's why they threw it. They like not she, you're not automatically a female character. You could be whatever you want. So it's kind of, I like that, which also kind of makes, I mean, theoretically though, for most of the route, because right now, Akira, Ryuji, Yusuke, On, and Akechi are the only ones in there that like, for the most part, if you're playing, as a female character, you only have one gay relationship. And if you're playing as a male character, they're basically almost all gay relationships. So, you know, and maybe if other people are interested, they'll add uh, some of the other characters in, you know, as long as Yusuke gets fucking put in here. Okay. I just need to date Yusuke for fuck's sake. Looks at my little Yusuke shrine over there with my two acrylic stands and my little Nendroid. <laughs> I didn't have any, like, most of my shit spread across my apartment, but they were over there. My pop figure's somewhere else. But anyway, are you looking for someone? You know, the detective prince, the catchy Goro. Okay. You know, you know, I think I saw someone with the same hair color. <laughs> Seriously? Oh, God, my poor ears. Where did he go? That way, towards the station. I mean, technically, I'm not lying. Thank you, thank you, thank you! Don't mention it. The two girls rush toward the main street and you sigh wistfully. Okay. 
Hello, good sir. How black can you make your coffee? The store owner looks at you strangely and flashes a wary smile. Depends on how thick you need it to be, kid. Just don't blame me when you get a heart attack or something. That was not the voice he had before, but whatever. You take a sweeping look around the area. Okay, so one customer. Watch the TV. The news program is playing, and the newscaster is talking about some politics that are happening overseas. It's kind of depressing. You power through it, though, and they move on to a new topic, which is the recent mental breakdown cases. Among the various information, you hear the name Detective Prince, and you snap your fingers in recognition. Oh, that's who those girls were stalking! That poor dude. You don't watch much TV, do you? Yeah, not really. <laughs> uh, he's really famous, huh? He's really famous, huh? I suppose. What's with the flashy title? Because the, the other options were we chose. I don't know if... There was any other choice between talk to him and TV... At, between those two? We'll go back and do it again and just find out. What's with the flashy title? Well, he's a detective. Obviously. But perhaps the general public finds his appearance and conduct pleasant to their eyes. Hence, he was nicknamed thus. Okay. Is he a good person? Well, everyone seems to think he is. Hmm. But what do you think? Okay. I'm just excited because it smells like heaven. The first spoonful of curry touches your tongue and you hum an approval at the deliciousness. Okay. That's the same. So underrated! Why don't more people know about this place? Okay, so... Sometimes the choice, when you click it, it, act it types it out and sometimes it assumes that you said it, so I wasn't quite sure. So anyway... You should invest in some marketing campaigns. Get the business booming. Nah, it's fine as long as I get by. Hmm, well, maybe I can at least tell my friends about this place. It'd be a shame if the shop closes down just because there are not enough customers. Okay. He briefly glances down at you, stuffing your mouth with more curry. Wait, what? Oh, okay, ring me up. And uh, could you give me their bill too, please? Wait, what? Why? Well, you did technically help me with those fangirls. What fan? Suddenly, a ringtone that isn't yours fills the entire room, and the boy briefly glances at his cell phone. Okay, that's the same. Okay. <laughs> that's actually kind of fun. Well, okay. Uh, we're just gonna... I just wanna... Because there was a couple other choices. There was one other dialogue line. Um, yes, I'm sure. Huh? Right. Lovely place. Greet him. Okay. Oh, okay. There was a difference. So, okay, perfect. Are you a regular? Is something like that. Is it because of the food or is it... Or it's... Oh. Is it because of the food or it's the atmosphere that does it for you? The coffee is exquisite, but the shop, it's, shop itself is cozy too. Well, now I'm looking forward to this. The brunette chuckles at the starry-eyed look you throw as you look around the establishment. Okay. Uh, he's really famous, huh? What's he like? We already did all these. But is he a good detective? This is the only other difference. Okay, perfect. We've done all the choices now. Is he a good detective? He has a good track record. I see. Sorry for interrupting your chat, but I got your order. Um... Okay. People say that all the time, but I'm just me. So underrated. Okay. So we did all the choices. Awesome! Woo! Um, so here's the thing. Uh, let's go load. We're gonna come back here. Um, what? Wait, let's do the sun for a second again. Yes, I'm sure. On second thought, take your time and think about what you really want. Oh, interesting. Romance targets Akira, Ryuji, and Akechi, but Ryuji isn't there. Unless it's because we did the sun? Maybe he's not a, doesn't have a sun. Okay, the moon. Intuitiveness, deception, insecurity, and yet so mysteriously enchanting. I personally think it's a good card. Yeah, I like that better. Deception insecurity totally me i see 
You're afraid of the unknown and find it hard to reach out to people most of the time. Mm -hmm. Despite that, you're loyal and extremely supportive to those who have gained your trust. And you'll always support the ones you love, even from the shadows. Like how the moon reflects light from the sun. I, this is I'm changing his voice now. Look, I don't know what's happening. This will be interesting. I look forward to your journey. Are you sure this is the card you want? Yes. Let's move on. Next, select the route you wish to proceed with. Don't be shy now. Tell me who you desire. Aha! Okay, I'm actually going to save here now. Um. Okay, here's the thing. Um. I'm just thinking. We did all the sun routes, and we just... You know what? It's only been 50 minutes. It's not quite an hour. But... I think what we should do is stop here and we'll finish the demo in the, like, next part. So we'll do two parts of this. So this is good. I wanted to at least do this. We needed some kind of interim stuff because I wasn't ready to, like, so we got some. I, I was a little, I'm a little behind on recording some other stuff until some of the other new games come out. So then I was like, let's do this. It's going to be short. I figured it might only be like a part. Um, but well, let's make it two. So I'm going to stop this here. And we will do the moon route in the next part. So I will see you guys next time and we will finish this demo. So remember to give the video a big thumbs up. Also, go check out the link down below if you want to play the game yourself. Um, or if you want to follow the game on itch.io or you want to donate a coffee to the creators so that they can hopefully continue to do this, um, and keep plugging along. So, but yeah, I will see you guys next time. Remember to give the video a big thumbs up and subscribe to see more.